Today is the first day of Black History Month. Nikki Wesley spoke to the Canadian Caribbean Association of Halton President Andrew Terrell to find out how you can participate. Andrew, you've got a ton of things planned for this Black History Month this February, but I'd love you to start off by telling us just a little bit about your chosen theme, Imagining Futures. For us, Imagining Futures means uh, a respect paid to the to all of the things that that uh, Black people have brought to the community for over the years, but also it's respect to the fact that we are embracing inclusion. And when the community as a whole does, does better, then Black people in that community do better. So at the Canadian Caribbean Associ Association of Halton, we, we embrace that. And uh, a lot of our programming that you'll see is not only black focused, it's for the entire community. So the community as a whole will grow. And as the community as a whole grows, then uh, us as black people in that community that in Halton only makes up 3% will grow. So let's talk a little bit about some of the things that you do have on tap for this month. You've got an incredible range of events going on. Um, you're kicking it off with your, uh, of course, the launch. And then you've got, you know, you've got Lawrence Hill, you've got history of Oakville, you've got a paint night. Tell, tell me about some of the things you'd really like folks to know about. Well, we'd like you to know that uh, as a community, everybody is invited. We have a lot of stunning and dynamic programming coming out for February. And uh, to kick it off, we have our a relaunch, Black History Month launch, and it was filmed in the Oakville Center for Performing Arts. We have Sonia Collymore, who's a two-time Juno Award winner. I am there as well. And uh, we have a professor from Sheridan. His name is Mohammed Banda. And we have a number of other community contributors uh, for an evening that is going to be fun, is going to be engaging, it's gonna be educational, but you're gonna come away from that inspired. And that's what we're looking for. So we're really excited that Lawrence Hill decided to use the Canadian Caribbean Association's Black History Month to launch his book in collaboration with the Catholic Board. It's a new children's book. It's called Beatrice and Croc Harry. And that book, is going to be really the catalyst of a discussion that he's going to have with high school, elementary students, uh, all kinds of different students from across the, the across Canada. That's just two of the CCAH's many events for this month. We will give you more details on some of the others throughout the month-long celebration.